What's up kiddos, Clinton Yates here at the beginning of AwesomeCon. They're trying to break a Guinness World Record for the most people cosplaying in one place. Let's see if they can do it. We're here with Ben from Awesome Conventions. You run AwesomeCon. Yeah. We're trying to break the record for largest number of people dressed as comic book characters. That's like, I get it right. Dennis is very specific. <laughs> right. I think we're going to be close. I don't know if we're going to quite get there, but I think we're going to be really close. So, we're going to do some trivia. In 2006, IGN rated Jean Grey what on their list of top 25 X-Men from the past 40 years? Let's go with 10. That is not correct. It is C6. In 2011, IGN ranked her 13th in a separate poll in the top 100 comic book heroes. In the 1989 movie Batman, who played Harvey Dent? That's Tommy Lee. Incorrect. Oh. Oh. Billy D. Williams. Come on, you gotta know Billy D. In 1946, Tracy's two-way wristwatch became an iconic symbol of the detective. What was that accessory upgraded to in 1964? A, hey, wrist TV. Correct, it was a wrist TV. You gotta get a shot of this guy's watch because it is amazing. Captain America Winter Soldier, the legendary Stan Lee plays a somewhat nondescript character. What is he? He's a Smithsonian guard. Bingo, that is correct. Stan Lee is who, for the people who don't know? Stan Lee is one of the major players behind Marvel Comics. He invented a lot of characters, including Spider-Man. He did not invent Captain America, but he did help revitalize him in the 60s with the Avengers comics. Dude, thank you very much. This guy knows the stuff. We didn't quite make the record. Uh, we only had 237. Give it a shot. The mighty 237 cosplayers. 